back to our channel இந்த வீடியோக்குள்ள போ முன்னாடி நீங்க ஒன்னும் நம்ம சேனல்ல சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணலாம் மறக்காம சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணிக்கோங்க வாங்க வீடியோக்குள்ள போலாம் back to our channel and this video we are going to solve the today's daily challenge so i have got many responses from the yesterday's video so if you didn't watch till now i have read my youtube income too so people go and just watch that video so which i upload yesterday so now let's get started solving today's question so the question is extended divisibility so what we should do is we must get two integer values that is n and k as the input and we must form a list of integers okay we must form a list of integers the first value in the list is n okay and they have given a condition here if n is divisible by k then the integer value n by k must be added to the list for k times okay the k times then we must repeat the process for all newly added integers in the list and finally we must print the integers values in the list as the output okay so this is a one question so what we are doing is first we must get the input uh, n and k and we must uh, let me first tell the logic of this code and we must initialize the list num list uh, with n then we are going to use a while loop to check if the current number is divisible by k or not and if it divisible then we must compute the num list of index that by k and we must append the value to k times to the num list and move to the next index okay like that we are going to do so and today i'm going to solve this one using the python language so initially i'm going to get the n and k from the user so int comma input dot split okay so dot split here and get the num list so num list will be the n and initially the index will be equal to zero okay now we must process the list based on the given logic so that is uh, using the while loop here so while num list of index percentage k is equal to zero okay then the value will be equal to num list okay then num list of index by k okay and now the num list will get extended to the value extended to the value into k okay and now the index will incremented by one and finally we are printing the num list okay so okay index yeah yeah you can see that our code has been successfully passed without getting any error and if this video finds useful please do like and share for more videos and i will see in the next video thank you